Hey guys, it's the Pontiff. How are you? How are you guys today? You guys okay? Are you happy? Are you feeling 100%? Tell me what's going on, guys. I want to know. I want to know how you guys are feeling. Tell me how you're feeling. Tell me how you are feeling. Tell me how you are feeling. I want to know. I want to know your feeling. How are you feeling? It's, um, this is the Archie Luxury live stream show. We are live streaming. We're having some fun. We'll just get the whole caboodle on the air. Let's see what we can do. What can we do? The dog trainers. We're trying to get anyone I can get on here. And um, that is the the way it is fucked. And I'm just going to have a talk to my... What's Clivus saying here? Yeah, it's fucked. Hello? What's going on? I see. It's wire. Yeah, it's all fucked. I don't think... I, I've got 12 people on a live show. What's going on? Yeah. Oh, fuck. Why is it so bad? What's happened? Yeah, I think there's some sort of outage there. It's fucked. It's fucked, you know? Yeah, yeah, no, no, I'm going to fix you up now, my friend. I can't believe it. It's all fucked at the moment there. Um, how are you going? You okay? Yes. Have you ever gone out with a Christian? <laughs> have you I mean how, how do you bet a Christian without the problem is I got all this religious guilt <laughs> yeah 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 Pentecostal evangelistic you know Jesus talking in tongues okay how, how, is it worth going there for a bit of illicit pussy or it's not really Sorry? <laughs> oh, I see. I see. Because I don't want to get married. You understand? I don't want to marry them. I don't want to be hitched to them. You, 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 you understand? <laughs> don't you? I just want to fuck their brains out. Is that wrong? Yes. I can do that. Yes. I see. I see. So it's it's not worth doing then or, or is it fun? How do you find how do you find Pentecostal pussy? Can I ask you that? Oh, they, they, they're nuts, aren't they? Okay. Okay, thank you. Hello, guys. We've got the, the rancher. My favorite rancher is coming on here. <laughs> the rancher. I love the rancher. 
I love my rancher. I love my rancher. He's cool. What the hell's going on on YouTube today? Holy shit. It's all good. It's very good. It's really good. The rancher. I love my rancher. Hello, the rancher. The rancher is on the air. How are you? <laughs> Okay, now I can see the comments on live stream uh, on uh, on uh, Streamtard. That's weird. Yeah, it's weird. Hey, talk to me about this. I'm 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 grooming a Pentecostal bird, right? Right. She and tells also, me. And also, let me give you my background. My mother, yes. my mother was Church in the Nazarene. Okay. And how, if, how fundamental are they? Let me put this way: if yeah. Pentecostals. If Pentecostals are Nazis, the Nazarene are like fucking SS. Oh, I see. Is that so? As a kid, did you tithe as a family? No, we thankfully Dad won the coin toss. We grew up Cumberland Presbyterian, but actually, I had a great uncle George that was a Nazarene preacher. Though, God, I remember like family, just going off this little country wooden country church in the middle of nowhere. It was summer, and my God, it was hot. They're talking about. They're talking, and of course, he's preaching about hellfire, and we felt we felt like we're in hell already. Did they tithe? Do you know they had this tithing, don't they? Yeah. What do you, what's what's your opinion on tithing, Clive? Well, um, if you're a committed Christian, you, know, you owe ten percent to God. Otherwise, it's stealing from God. <coughs> but doesn't taxes take care of that? Because the Bible was written when. They didn't really have many services, okay? Uh, oh, okay, Dan. Dan, I'm from the flyover states, dude. Seriously. Um, well, as far as I know, the Bible has not been up. Well, actually, it was updated. It was technically called the New Testament, but I think the New Testament pretty much didn't talk about tithing. Render unto Caesar what is Caesar's. Render unto God what is God's. I see. So, so I don't understand. That means you're not really into it, then. Is that right? No, not really. Um, you know, I used to go. I used to go in just for weddings. Now it's just pretty much funerals. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. That thing you requested that money that's in US dollars the 40 of course you would never work in Australian of course. sorry apology apology yeah because well yeah because obviously because you, you, you're in America yeah Jesus it's the United Christ. States Postal Service yeah no 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 it's okay because just that how the request came through you know that request you sent me yeah it's trying to send me get me to do it in Aussie dollars but you don't want fucking Aussie dollars that's okay I'll send it to you Okay. Thank you. I'm just doing it because I'm going to cancel that request and I will send it another way. Well, yeah, because that pretty much confirms the email or the PayPal address. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cool. So, uh, right. And actually, they also charge <clears throat> they also charge by weight. So I didn't defecate in your protect fleet box, but it's not because I'm a good person. It's that I didn't want to pay extra to mail my feces to you. Ah, the cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Kind of a shame. I had Mexican the night before, too. Yes, I'm just sending you 50 bucks, okay? Oh, that's... Wow. Wait, where's our, who are you and where's Archie? <laughs> I'm just sending you 50 bucks. Have a coffee on me, okay? That's awfully... That's... Yeah, that's... Uh, that is... I'm, I'm trying to think of the adjective. I'm, I'm trying to think Clive, of the Clive, it's seven dollars. It's not. It's not anything special, okay? But it's you. Yeah, I know it's, it's seven dollars. It's seven dollars, Clive. No, the point is, it's not that anyone is kicking in an extra seven dollars. The point is that you're kicking in an extra seven dollars. That's, but that's especially. 
that's the that's know, the right. whole point. Yeah, Clive, I, I've now that I got the six Patex and I don't have Rolex, I'm not such a tight ass cunt anymore. Six Patex? Whoa, 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 whoa! Five Patex, five Patex. Okay, what you buy? What did okay, you buy? Okay, okay, okay. Here we go, Mister Roto. One, Mister C, one dollar, and Gout Stout four five two two dollars. Brand new, Aqua Terra, Aqua Terra. Blue box and papers, 3K US. Not bad. Not bad at all. What do you reckon? Yeah, I got it used for 2500 and I thought it was I thought it was a great deal for that. By the way, what are you drinking? I am drinking ginger beer. Saxby's ginger beer. Nice. That, that could expl <coughs> explain the weight gain, you know? Yeah, yeah, good, good possible, yeah. Well, here's what, here's what sucks, though. I can't, I have to be really careful. I can't even have diet sodas because just the carbonation is apparently hell on my teeth. Oh, oh your teeth. You, you've actually got your own teeth? Yes. Cool. Also, I've got my own hair, which I'm more proud about, frankly. Yes. Yeah, I don't blame you. Uh, I had a, a Virgin Airline pilot. He's um, he's got to desperately get out of a Patek Philippe. Well, I you think that's weird because you think airline pilots would get all the food tanks. He's got to sell. I said, do you understand? Yeah, but you also said he's a virgin. Virgin, virgins the airline clivers. Yes, you're you're. That's the airline. Virgin is the airline, that Richard Branson conglomerate. And um, So what's the, what's the reference on this one? 5127, exactly like mine, except it's got the extra dots near the date. It's a little bit newer than mine. Well, I'm okay. selling it for, 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 for basically 16.7. U.S. or Aussie? U.S., 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 U.S. How, how big is it? Tell us about the watch. What, what, 37, 37 with the crown guards, the horn guards. It's got nice. the horn guards. Absolutely beautiful. So, um, I, you know, he, he's, he's, look, I tell you what happened to him. Okay. So he's in his mid forties, two marriages, leased Mercedes Benz. He has a expensive inner city apartment. And no job. Yeah. And, and he's got to pay his child support on, on three of the kids. Yep. And guess it, it, Well, yeah, he, could, he might be able to go get a lowered temporarily. He might be able to get a what? Lowered temporarily, but... Well, the, the because, Mercedes, he's got to pay that. It's a lease. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. They, they're not giving him any concessions. Do you understand? Yeah. Speaking about getting concessions, where are the Super Chats? Exactly. You hit it on the head there, Clivis. Exactly. You're a good man. You know this? I no, love you. No, I'm a, I'm a horrible human being because I'm on your channel. Yeah, you love this channel, Clive. We know the truth. Um, I got. I was. I just. The only reason I'm drinking the ginger beer today is I was scared that my YouTube channel had gone under. I thought, oh no, what's happened? No, no is ginger beer actually alcoholic? No, you can get alcoholic ginger beer, but the ones I just. This is just a soft drink. Actually, Scotty left them here. Scotty brought them over. That's because I don't buy soft drinks. Scotty left them here. That's what happened. Scotty, you know my friend Scotty. Yes. Yeah. Did you ever get Scotty. a uh, Did you ever get a Submariner out of the uh, pawn shop? Oh yeah, no, that was ages ago. That's been done. It's all fixed. He's forgiven me for that. Pantsless Scotty. Mm. That's the Scotty. Yeah, he's a cool guy, Scotty. Now, Archie, have you thought about drinking tonic water? Actually, that tastes pretty awful. Have you tried that Indian tonic? I hate that stuff. I do too, but you. I like soda water. What about soda water? Yeah, but you realize that you there's don't no want... calories in soda water. What? Well, it has carbonation, but you know why the British drink tonic water? Why is that? 
it helped against malaria. Did it? Yeah. Okay. Gin, gin and tonic was the official, the unofficial drink of the empire. Yes, gin and tonic, alcoholics. I could. Right. No. We were talking about Punang before, Pentecostal Punang. Is it, is it tastier because it's illicit? Oh yeah. Well, at least it's always more. It's always tastier at first, though, isn't it? Yeah. Gin and tonic, Tanzil. Oh, right. sorry, super chat. Here we go, Tanzil. Two dollars, gin and tannic. Thank you very much. There, by the way, Tan, I'm selling a five one two seven, sixteen seven. Not bad price. It's not a bad price, really. No, not at all. But tell me this, Pentecostal pussy. How does it taste? How does it feel? God, Archie, that was like 30 years. No, God, almost 35 years ago. I see. So tell me this. How did, how, how did it go with the church? Your mother was a fundamental Christian, not only being abusive. 16, 8. There we go. Just under 17. I prefer, how did... I prefer to think it was just mildly mentally ill. But no, we, 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 weren't, brought, we weren't brought up in the... In, Nazarene or you know, Pentecostal, we uh, Cumberland Presbyterian. So oh. much. Oh yeah, thank thank God for that. Watches and giggles, two dollars. Ah, it's just a reminder. Wrap it up before you tap it. This 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 one's. I don't think this one's shooting. Um, look, once once they're over fifty four, it's very very difficult, isn't it? But not impossible. Okay, thank you. So tell me this, Christian pussy. Uh, now tell me this. So how do you how do you bed a Christian girl? What's the best way? I, I don't want to have to marry her and all this sort of shit. Because, I just well, wanna... here, here's the reason why. Because the more illicit it is, the more they like it. Because it's it's more rebe it's a quiet little rebellion against their strict standards. Even even the top even top Christian leadership goes out every once in a while and says screw it and screws it. You know, Jerry, oh, Jerry, Jerry, yeah, oh. Jerry. So actually, actually, unless you, 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 did I tell you I had a Christian, another Christian girlfriend? Okay, I had this Taiwanese girlfriend. She was a fundamental Christian, you know, speaking in tongues. Ouch. And she's always trying to hit me up for a handbag, a Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton handbag, right? And just between you and me, Rancher, they're fucking expensive. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Do you understand, Rancher? They're fucking expensive. I'm not going to give it to some floozy. So I said to her, I sent her a text. So I'd been out on two dates with her. And I said, you know what? To make it fair for you, how about I give you $100 for every session we have together? Okay. And you can buy that. You can buy that Louis Vuitton handbag yourself. What you yeah, that's what I said. I said, I said look, you, you, we just do it. I'll come once a week. You keep the cash. And I said, I'll give you a romantic card. I'll put the money in and I'll give you a perfume. And we'll have two and a half hours of fun. And then I'll take you to lunch. Okay? Right. Yeah. And, you, and you, you know what she said to that? What do you think a fundamental Christian girl said to that? Hell yeah. See you at 10.30 tomorrow. Here's my address. Uh, Tanzil Nanza. Tanzil, $5. $5. $5. And we've got Omega Speedmaster Man on the Trickin' Moon or Rolex Explorer 2 Polar. If you could only have one and why, actually, I've been thinking about this. I want to get a sports watch for myself. Omega, Omega, Omega. You know why? It's a third of the price. Well, yeah, and it, yeah, because right now, yeah, there are there are no Rolex fire cells so far. That's exactly right. You know, that's exactly it. So, I mean, Rolex. I don't know if Rolex is really good bang per buck, do you? 
See, I don't know. It's it's hard to tell because in this, it, it's just I, I I'm not sure if the recent courts. Uh, oh God, we could talk the rest of the night on this. Wait, shouldn't we have Mark on if we're ta- the uh, Rolex fanboy? If we're talking about Rolex, Mark, he's the the fanboy, isn't he? Yeah, man. Bring him on. You got to bring the cup out. You got to rub this tummy. I think. No, 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 no. He, no. I actually, I actually broke my own rule and came on for once, without being rubbed. I don't have a mark. I don't have a. I don't have a Goldberg mug. Oh, you don't. No, he doesn't have much. Wow. Sometimes I wonder if I should get some more of those made up. People sure seem to like them, though. I think they were fucking clever. I love them. I love them. I thought, and I wanted to get one myself. You know this? Well, actually, the joke was going to be, I was going to get a whole bunch and give them to everyone except you. I know. I know. I know. I know. That's why I really wanted one. Yeah. Kind of like Rolex. Yeah, See, exactly we- like Rolex. Exactly like Rolex. I actually, stopped, I actually stopped by my AD. Yes. Of course, they're all wearing masks. Yes. But uh, they're saying, no, we haven't got squad in since early March. Well, of course, of course, the factory shut down. And I basically said, you know, what we, the enthusiasts, you know, we call ADs now, date just are us. They just are us. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. They just are us. That's so cool, Clive. It's about the only. I. I. Um, how it's about? The, no, it, that's what we used to call them. Now, now they're the two tone tabernacle. Two tone tabernacle. Yeah. I. I honestly find it hard to accept that Rolex. This is all bullshit. I. I think. Do you think it's the Chinese? I. I was talking to a watch dealer about this yesterday. He's. He's convinced it's the Hands Chinese. Tanzil man. Tanzil, Tanzil man, Tan the man, Tan the man, you are the one, five dollars, Clyde, rub that BBC dildo live on air to summons Mark, open sesame. Uh, Dr. BBC has not given me a dildo. Mm. Okay. And also it should be open says me. Open says, okay. Uh, talk to me, Clive. Is, do you, any, is there any Rolexes in the flyover state? Sports? Steel uh, sports? There's like um, a two-year-old 214-270, a Mark II, Bach Complete Kit for like six. 214-270. Brand new or what? Two-year-old. Two-year-old. They sell pre-owned? No, no. Oh, no, no, no. You mean at the AD? Oh, no. There's yeah. something, you know. It, no, it, they, two, you've got gold and you've got steel and gold. Oh, That's pretty much it. Fuck, even in Oklahoma? Yeah. Well, actually, no, actually, I take that. I thought up. that Oklahoma would be, you, you could get Daytonas in this store. No, we're, we're not, no, we're not that behind the times. And we have a lot of, a, believe it or not, we have a lot of Rolex ADs. Now, they did have an OP uh, 36. One one six zero zero zero. Ah, who wants to buy that? Well, it was a blue explorer. Yeah. Fucking hell. I don't know what to say. No, it's just like even. But the thing is, I think if you see, I don't know because. <sighs> no, actually, you know, the gazillionaire actually sent me an email, and uh, he yes. basically, well, okay. Bershee's on Nanza. Bershee, five dollars. Are you familiar with Vasher and Constantine's La Eris Sisters collection? They are really pieces of art. Pull them up. Pull them up. Pull them up. This is the Vasher run. While you're doing that, while you're doing that, you can answer the Tanzil Nanza. Are you running a fan in the background? No, 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 no. Is that no, the no. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think it is. Tanzil, five dollars. AC three, which of the following would you have if you had to keep one? P- 
Parmagani, Fiero, H. Moser, and C. Bang, Beagle, Bagel Sport, or Tudor Hydronaut. I'd probably go, actually, out of all of that, you know what I'd really, I would pick seriously? I'd take the, the poser, the yep. H. Poser, and so. Okay. Now, here's something. Here's Okay. Let's go back. Go back and answer. Let's answer Barisha, and then, then we'll talk. Okie dokie. We're going to Barisha. 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 This is the... This is the... How do I spell it? La L? Is that it? L hyphen? What, what, what's the... What the arrow of spheres? Uh, it's not coming up. Nothing's there. Arrow. What's the arrow? A... I spell Alpha, Echo, Romeo, Oscar, Sierra, Tango, India, Echo, Romo, Romeo, Sierra, over. See, nothing's coming up. Nothing. What, what the hell is he talking about? What's he talking about? Okay, Brisa, send us a link. We'll try to keep an eye open for it. Send us a link yeah, to it. Yeah, Pull we it can't find it. We're only, we're, there's nothing's coming up. Okay. Yeah. I got to tell you, Clivers, I got to tell you seriously. I would like to see, um, I, I would really like to see something besides Rolex hitting the fan. I've got a, what do you think of Grand Seiko? Would you ever go that way? Well, you know, someone sent me a, Vincent, Vincent from the left coast sent me like a, 37 millimeter manual wine Grand Seiko, Japanese only model, and I thought cool. I thought it was a great watch. Tanzil Nanza. Tanzil Nanza. There we go. Tanzil. AC3 five dollars. I assume you were the first one out in the Oxley Junior High spelling B. Yes. Yes. Now Tanzil, that's not very. That's not. That's not fair. Come on. You know his. You know his school bus only had two axles. So I got to tell you, Clivers, I'm getting, I'm getting sick of Rolex. I don't know about you. Are you Barisha sick of Barisha Nanza. Barisha Nanza. Barisha Nanza. Five bucks, Barisha Nanza. Sorry. It was Metteurs de Art. Fuck me dead. Met. Look, no, no. Just Metteurs. I found it. it. Found it. Found it. Found it. Here we go. Okay. He actually sent you the link followed. All you had to do was copy and paste. But No, that's okay. So look, look at these. What do you think of these? Rodents. There's one for the rodents. Look. Uh, Is it your cup of tea? Uh, I don't know. I don't, Paddock does something similar too. I prefer this. It, it would be hideously expensive. Anything Vacheron like this would be ridiculously fucking expensive. Well, that's where you have. That's where you're. Oh, here's one for me, Clivus. Look, the pig. Uh, it should be a boar. Does it have tusks? I'm sure they could add them. I'm sure they could add them if necessary. Oh, Mark. Oh, check the lobby. Mark is in the lobby. It's a look. Oh, he is too. Hello, Mark man. Hello, hello. How are you? Hey, we summoned you there. You did. Sadly, I won't be able to stay too long. I have a. That's okay. That's okay. The 30 minutes yeah. is nearly coming up, and we've Perfect. got Google problems. It's fucked. What's happened to YouTube? It's shit. Hmm. But you know what it is with co with uh, Corona, and everybody uh, on lockdown. They're getting a ton more traffic, I think, than normal. So, I've gotten you know all the creators are getting warnings that it might take longer to upload stuff. Stream Streamyard sent something out, didn't they, which said you know you might get less bandwidth than usual because blah 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 blah. Everyone's using. Oh look, look. Do you think Archie bothers to read anything from Streamyard or YouTube? Come on. Maybe it's Bill. Yeah, I do actually. I have the subscribe service. I don't know if you noticed this. There's no logo in the corner. Yeah. I have the subscribe yeah. service. Nice. Well. And um, I want to say, man, what do you think of these Vacheron art pieces? Paddock was doing the same thing. They kind of have the pig. Yeah, I, I know. That's the one I chose. The pig. Is there one with a minotaur and horns. Tanzil there's there's a rodents. There's rodents. Nanza. Tanzanza. There is rodents. Oh. Tanzanza. Tanzanza. I'll just show you the rodents quickly. 
Okay, here we go. Ten the man! Ten the man, five dollars. TGV said he would let me back into the Urban Gentry Facebook group if I wrote if you wrote me a letter of recommendation and I wrote a ten paragraph essay on shit is Oh, he's gone. Oh Mark, he's gone. You know that? Barisha Nanza. Here we go, Barisha Nanza. Here we go. I'm talking specifically about the ones with the hot air balloons. The hot air balloon ones. Yes, yes, that's a hot air balloon. Yeah, that. Well, I must admit they are. They look. It looks pretty damn amazing. What do you think, Clive? They, yeah, but at, is, what, but at which point? At which point does it go from being a highly decorated timepiece to just being outright jewelry? Yeah, I understand exactly what you're saying there. Now, actually, what I, I show, too bad I'm not on camera. I'm you know, logged on on basically I, on the desk, laptop rather than the desktop. But actually, what I pulled out and started wearing like uh, yesterday, the day before, is the blue, the forty-one blue Romans. Oh, yes, that was on our Facebook group. Yes, 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 that looked amazing. It really, really does. But, and, and the thing is, though, when I was looking at it, it was just like the, the steel on it, it looks so good compared to, I mean, you honestly can't really tell where the gold ends and the steel begins just by looking at it. It almost, wow. look, it almost does look like, it's almost jewelry fine. Wow, that's amazing. Well, yeah, and the funny part is, so I want the idea. Of course, I was wearing the, I was wearing the blue Romans, and you know, everyone there are a couple of people who are noticing. Oh wait, wait, where's the gold on that one? There is no gold on this. Well, except for the bezel. Also, Tanzil. Tanzil has one just like it, or almost like it. Tanzil Nanza. Tan the Zeal, the man. Tan the man. AC3, do you prefer these timepieces from VC or a filthy Ulysses Narden watch of a scene outer Orchard Towers? Double penetration action orchestrated by the watch crown. Very, yes, they have some sex ones. You know that, don't you, Clivers? I've heard about them. Yes, yes, very good. Stand the man, $2. Do you buy watches for resale only? Resale value Good, good question. I, I, um, hmm. That's a very good question. Well, okay, but my response is, buy what you love, but you, you do your homework first. Yes, buy what you love, but do your homework first. Mm. And, and the thing is, though, and Stan, if I was do, buying... Uh, on resale only, I wouldn't have paid MSRP on a uh, on a date just forty one. Mm. But I don't know; it's so crazy though. You can't even get the freaking PGA forty ones. No, no, but you got the blue dial. That's that's investment. That that you. What are they, are they going for less than retail on the used market? Well, I've actually. I, someone was saying I was looking. I said, "Well, uh, basically." Uh, they were talking. I said, "Look on the used market. It's a date just. It can't be that much. You know, you at least certain you'd have to be able to find a good deal on a day just." And his response is, "No, the one I want, the one I want is above going above MSRP even now on the used market." But of course, the hot wow. one, the hot ones are steel jubilee on white gold fluted bezel. Have they started rolling back restrictions in your state? What's happening in Oklahoma? Ah, uh, yeah, actually, they're they're. Restaurants are opening. Uh, if they can keep social distancing, uh, you know, they're giving everyone, uh, you know, hand sanitizer is everywhere. I see. Yeah, starting to. They're gonna they're gonna start moving into electronic filing. It's like, oh god, oh god, no, 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 please, no, no, no. They've been trying to get us to do it for a while, and basically the private bar was digging its heels in. Doing, you know, and I think, unfortunately, I think this damn virus is going to give the Bar Association and the courts the excuse they need to drag us oh. all. 
And what do you have against electronic filing? Because it's not going to be uniform. And they're going to even start doing like Zoom litigation. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Yeah, that's dial a be- lawyer. Just, just dial a lawyer yeah. on YouTube. Yeah. Like, and, it, and, and it's like, and it's uh, uniform. So literally, that means that any district judge, I mean, do you realize how much software we'll have to load on our damn computers? Oh fuck! Which one does he want? Which one does? Which one does Judge Napoli want? Oh, oh fuck! Judge Napoli is a Mac man. I'm a PC man, or oh, he's the guy with the PC. It's like, oh no, he's he's the he's the Zoom holdout. Okay, and then we got a then we got something else. You know, if if it's done uniformly, if they put a little thought into it, theoretically it could be great for us because you know, we could just sit in the office and literally appear in four counties in the morning mm. and not have to worry about any drive time or parking. Mm. But if it's done right as the as the imperative word. Tanzil Nanza. Tanzil Nanza. Ah, here we go. Um, uh, Tanzil Nanza, five dollars. AC3, pull up the 33 mil Ed White on the Amiga website reference. Da 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 yeah, exactly. Yeah, okay. that's, I'll that's, read out the num- I'll read out the number of people. Yeah, okay. Okay, let me know when you're ready. Okay. Yep. Three one one dot three zero dot four zero dot three zero dot zero one dot zero zero one over. Oh, uh, by the way, we're also being told we missed the super champ from Aunt G. Fuck, 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 Aunt G, two dollars. Build a five-piece Rolex collection, modern and vintage. Here, this is what I would do. You know what I would do? Five-piece perfect combo meal deal. I would go, this is, this is a... But he hasn't given us, okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, we'll have to come back to that. Cause that's going to be a time burner right there. Could, yeah, okay, we'll come back to that. We'll come back to that. Now, here we go. For the Ed White there, let's get this Ed White on the screen. What do you think? What do you think indeed there? This is the new 321 Ed White. It is beautiful. Look at that movement, 321. Right. It's fucking gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. Someone it looks like here. a... Someone it looks, Someone down here has the authentic vintage Ed White for like 14. That's the problem. You know, that is the problem. That's the problem. But it is, look, I I must admit, to be totally honest with you, ignoring the financial aspect, it is a fucking beautiful watch. It's beautiful. What do you think, Clive? I think it is. I think it's gorgeous. Is it better than a normal Speedy? Oh, debatable. It's a little bit smaller. Yeah, but I think it is no no holes case. Look at the case; it's the older case. Um, I think it's fucking beautiful. I don't know what. No, watch it. Guys... People said I love it, but I'm not paying what they want for it. <sighs> yeah, and I don't blame them for charging what they they've got to price it so it's almost just not affordable. They're yeah. Well, they're trying to they're trying to. They're trying to Daytona the fuck out of that. Well, and actually, mm. I, they, some people have called it the Omega Greedmaster. Yeah. By the way, there. Um, I think if you're going to spend that money, I, I would be buying a vintage. Like you've got, what you've got is ideal, don't you think? Uh, yeah. I, I and what makes it sweet is that you took it from an old lady from a Pentecostal church. No, actually, I, I took it from uh, the dead guy's daughter-in-law. <clears throat> oh. But you love it. You, you know this, don't you? Yeah, actually, classic, classic size. 
Now my A sixty one though looks better. Mm. Tanzil Nanza. Yes. That looks absolutely perfect. Tanzil Nanza. Tanzil Nanza. Tanzil Nanza. Tanzil Nanza. Tanzil Nanza. Here we go. Tanzil Nanza. This is the one man. Tanzil Nanza. Five dollars. AC three. Thoughts on whether the Ed White will sell for over retail twelve thousand. Oh, will crash and burn like your ratings. i got to be honest with you. I think it'll probably hold around the 10. If it's retailing for 12, it'll. it's a little bit under retail, but not substantially. Yeah. And I kind of think it's worth it. You, you know what I mean? It's, yeah. it's you, you reckon it's worth it? Because look at it this way. Okay, a vintage is very fragile and delicate. It's been fucked with. It doesn't quite reset. This is a brand new fucking three, two, one. You, that's kind of cool, isn't it? It's oh, brand is. new, crispy, minty, virginal. It's fucking. Um, that's what you want, crispy, minty, isn't it? Yes. All right. You want to have an Archie Vention? Sure. And you, 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 and guys in the audience, you know what an Archie Vention is. Now, you see, guys, if you have a friend that you are convinced is making a grave horological mistake, you could pay Archie to have an intervention on his watch choice. Exactly. It's an Archie, it's, it's an Archie Vention, and Archie will confront them directly from a position of support and love or greed and cash and b confront him about his poor horological choice that he's he or she is wanting to make exactly there, there's someone by me down here in the flyover states and they're they've just got a total heart on for the uh block pain 50 fathoms mill spec, oh, mill spec. what happened to donny haynes you know he, he's another one who had a hard on for pain, pain how did that end well, actually, I think mom and dad felt, you know, I think they assisted him in getting him out of the house and getting him into an apartment. So, oh, wait, Tanzil Nanza. Tanzil, $10. AC3, you don't consider the Sapphire sand Sandwich is not really a moon watch, not like the original. Will the Ed White fall back into the same category since it has Sapphire Crystal and Case Back, House Light Glass? Uh, I don't, look, I honestly, I don't think the Sapphire is the end of the world. Well, and I hate to say it, that watch, okay, there's two horological sins, I think, with, with case backs. Number one is displaying a case back that doesn't deserve it. And number two is not displaying a case back that does deserve it. Mm. Does this deserve it? I think it does. Definitely. The three, two, one definitely deserves. It. You're paying this money. What you can't see, what you're paying for, if you didn't. Like that, that overseas version one. You know that's got a Geneva, Geneva steel movement in it, and it's hidden behind solid case back. Yes. No. Okay. So he's talking about the mill spec. Mm. And of course. Blanc Payne is paying, playing the God, oh God, I hate this. 500 pieces. Yes. Now, have you ever seen the mill spec? Yes. I really like the mill spec. Yes. You have to, I think even you can't take that away. You look at it, it's like, damn, that is a gorgeous watch. Let's bring the baby up then. Let's bring this baby up then. Okay. Okay. Uh, G Stout 452. Nanza. Oh, okay. Sorry. Here's the, the mill spec. Sorry. Here we go. G start 452, $5. Clivers, have a drink. You deserve deserve it for carrying Archie. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, the mill G spec. This I'm is the mill I'm spec. Afraid, I'm afraid to build up yet, so I, I thank you for your compliment. I got to be honest with you. I'm not a huge blank pain fan, okay? 
I don't like many of them, but, but I... But this is fucking beautiful. God, yes! Yes, you exactly! Know? You know? Yes. I mean, I even like the orange and the white. Is, is, yeah! What is, you know, that's kind of funky off-center, you know? It's just... It's just fucking it, crazy. It, it vintage reissue done right. And here's the, here's the trouble with it, huh? It's what just, are they going for? Uh, well, I, I think 14.1 was the MSRP, but they only made 500 pieces mm-hmm. because... Fuck. Was, because the Swiss are cunts, and guess what? Mm. So his choices are like eighteen thousand for a complete mm. set, on, not even on the bracelet, on, on the rubber, and then Fuck. and then fourteen thousand on the bracelet, but without box and papers. And of course, you know, and because the leather on the cell cloth, the rubber on the cell cloth strap on block pane. It will if you take it in a pool, it will dissolve basically. Yes. <laughs> water breach, yeah, water breach warning circle. That's exactly what it is, Jay Wright. And I love that watch. But here, here's the here's the so, thing. Well, what is the 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 orange and the white? Is that something to do with the moisture? Oh. Has, has it been compromised? How does that work? Well, it turns a different color if water gets in there. It's like. It's like those little dots inside of a Mac. When the technician opens it, if the dot, if the white dots inside of it, in certain locations turn to red, he knows that there's been liquids inside the case. And I'll say, nope, warranty voided. I see. It's actually quite a good looking watch, but I, I don't know. I don't know if I'd be paying fucking eighteen thousand. You're talking U.S. dollars there. You're not yeah. talking Aussie dollars. Eighteen fucking thousand. You could buy a Calatrava in precious metal for that. <sighs> no. Yeah. I mean, fucking or, hell! It's a or, ten thousand. It, it's it's a. Or or you could buy two Mosier, uh, you know, endeavors. I think happen. it's a seven or eight thousand dollar watch. That's what I think it's honestly worth. Yeah, but the, is, that, the, is that rude? No. No, and I'm not, and you're not saying it's not. You're not saying it's not a bad watch. It's bad watch. It's beautiful. Not, yeah, it's yeah. beautiful. But it's but here's beautiful. the and, and here's the thing. The, it's only it's like forty millimeters, which is really the right size. It's not a pie plate, like the rest of them. Mm. But mm. okay, uh, stand the man Nanza. Stand the man two dollars Porsche nine eleven and Rolex Daytona Arch. Do it. Mm. Now, if Archie were to do that, the Rolex Daytona would probably cost more than the Porsche he'd buy. Yes. John Galt Nanza. I can't. Look, I tell you honestly, seriously, with the car thing, I've. It's John Galt Nanza, $5. No see through case on the new Speedy 321 would be like marrying a supermodel and not being able to see her naked. Wait, who's John Galt? Not sure. Not sure. You've never now, read I, you've never read Atlas Shrugged, have you? No, I haven't okay. read terribly much. Anything with with uses more than three syllables, I have troubles with. Now, Clivers, I want to tell you, I've decided. You know, on the Porsche, I've been looking at Porsches. I've got. I want to tell you no. something completely no. honest. Don't. I want to tell you something honest about the Porsche. I want to say this announcement on the channel. I love Porsches. I love Porsches, but you know something? I'm too fat, too old, and ugly to drive one, okay? I know my place. I'm Honda Civic. You know what? I love my... And you know what I've done? Can I tell you what I've done? Okay, Archie. To celebrate? Let me throw something out there. Civic Del Sol. What's that? You've never heard of a Civic Del Sol? Don't you get any good cars in Australia? Ah, yeah, okay. Sorry. P Alex five euros. Persuade your brother. Persuade my brother not to sell his sub for an Apple Watch. Oh my God, that's just lunacy. That's just crazy. Okay, P. Alex, <coughs> P. Okay, now P Alex, give Archie, give Archie your email address. Yeah. Archie will send you the link to, and you your brother can come on. We can have a yeah. we can have we can have a practice Archie vention right now. Exactly. Chip Wong, Chip Wong, $2. How is Don Haynes? Also, did Crappy die yet? We're not sure. Hopefully, he did. 
I gotta tell you, seriously, <sighs> you gotta tell you with the Porsche thing, you know something? I could afford to buy a second hand Porsche, but there's no way in the world I could afford to maintain it. Exactly. To celebrate sports cars, you know what I've decided to do on my Honda Civic, Clive? What's that? I've turned economy mode off. Yay. <laughs> it feels like a new car. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, econ I've turned economy. And G, build a five piece Rolex collection, modern and vintage. Okay, I'll tell you what I would do. This is what I would do I would get the basis covered firstly. You would need a bluesy two tone ceramic. Ah. Okay. Okay. Next piece I would have would be a Explorer 2 42 mil. Okay. That would okay. So that would take the chair of the GMT function. All right. Then I would get a Zenith Daytona. Rolex collection. Rolex. Oh, it's Zenith Daytona. Zenith Daytona. Okay. 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 That's vintage. Okay. Yes. Okay. That's three. And then. I would get, I would get a no date watch. Okay, I would get a Milgauss, Milgauss Z. I'd actually go the black. I'd go the black non GV. I, I I'd say an LP thirty nine in black or white. LP Oyster Perpetual thirty nine. Oh, OP 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 OP. And then finally to tap it all off. President. 40 mil, Clivers, 40 mil. 40 mil, 40 watches mil. And, watches and giggles, answer. Watches and giggles, five bucks. Pontiff, I own a Sea Dweller 43, Batgirl, Tudor Burgundy ETA, and an Explorer 1 on the way. What do I buy to complete my five-piece combo meal deal? So let's look at this. He's missing. Okay, let's look at this. He's got a He's Sea Dweller. That's his diver. He's got a Batgirl. That's his GMT. He's got a Tudor Burgundy. That's a secondary diver. He's got an Explorer. I reckon he needs something like a bit, bit dressy, a bit flash. Get a President if you can afford it. A President? <sighs> or maybe a Datejust with a white gold bezel like Clive's with the blue dial. That's gorgeous. Thank you. I appreciate that. It is. I'm not just saying it because I think that is fucking beautiful. That's that'd be a great look. I, I think that's probably better than the president. The president's too expensive. Let's be honest. Watches and giggles. It's a bit expensive. We don't want to push ourselves for for a watch we're not going to wear a lot. And it, the gold's a bit yellow. Gold is tacky. Hold on. Give me one second. Yes. Tanzi or five dollars. How much for us to invite Jin to your home and reshoot the gifting your protect to your son with Jin acting as AC4 and pretend it's a paddock commercial. Yes, sir. -y. Yes, sir. We, they were the good old days. Da da da. Da 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 da. da. Hello, Clive. All right. I'm here. I'm still here. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Just gonna make a last minute change. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I see. I see. <sighs> Come on. Damn it. God has taken this Mac forever to do anything since it. There we go. Mm-hmm. Not exactly the picture, but still. That's beautiful. That is absolutely beautiful. Look at that. White gold bezel. Or, or, or engine. No, that's white gold. That's white gold bezel, isn't that's it? That's white Yeah. Yep. I think it, yeah, I've got to be honest with you. I've seen the steel engine turned. It's never the same. White gold is the way to go for the bezel. It's fucking gorgeous with the Romans. I love, and the, there's actually two versions. There's sans serif and serif Romans. I don't know if you know, if you know that. Yes. And you've got the, 
the sans serif ones, I think. Oh, we lost him. What's going on? We lost him. We lost him. It's okay. Guys, I better wrap this show up there. It's been a great show. We had a longer show today. I love you all. I love you all. And, uh, oh, he's back. He's back. Hello. I was just going to wrap this baby up, Clivers. Unlike your Hello? penis. You're going to, unlike your penis. Exactly. Yes, yes, yes. I want to say thanks for coming on. Uh, guys, it's been great having you. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow. We're doing an hour show tomorrow. And uh, we did an hour show today anyhow. That's a pretty good bonus for the audience. But I've got to tell you, seriously, now, wait don't. Now, what if someone wants to join us for after hours chat? Yes. Off the air. Super chat, $10. $10? $10. Wait. No, 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 no. If you're only going to do $10, you're going to leave me on with them, goddammit. Okay. I know you. Okay, $20, $20. Okay. But, Clivers, i got to tell you, seriously, I'm being uninspired by Rolex. I was actually contemplating a Grand Seiko yesterday. Uh, sports or a sport, sporty or dressy? I, I, uh, dressy, I like, dressy, I like, dressy. Yeah, I, I don't like the sporty ones. I'm sorry. No, I, no, no, no. I, I tend to agree with you. I agree with you. And I also was looking at a Pam as well, a base logo Pam. Mm, a zero, zero, zero. No, no, it's actually... It's, but it, it's it's in that style. A base logo is a, is a triple zero. Uh, this was a three seven five I, or three five seven. I can't remember the number exactly. But um, it's it. There, there, there's a few. I like. I don't know. I don't know if I could go Pam again. But it's 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 cheap. It's affordable. I like. Affordable watches under the five thousand Aussie. That's three and a half US. I don't want to spend fucking ten thousand dollars US every time I want to watch. <sighs> yeah, well, and it, Rolex used to be that way. Rolex. Used I to know be that way. you could play with them, sell it, trade it, then come back. You could all, you know, it was so cool. But they've kind of become too expensive and too important. You know, it's like the guy you used to. It's like the guy in the mail room who used to play games with who became the president. He became the CEO, you Chad know? Came, Chad came in. Though. Chad, $5, $5. Arch, you need to make a decision. You always beat around the bush. Buy a date just or not. Yes, yes, yes. Dan Radke, the watch talk has been outstanding. Yes, I've enjoyed it as well. That's amazing there, so... I'm going to wrap her up. We will see you tomorrow. That's a good show, 